Hi, I'm Senior Chief Stockholm. I recently struggled with depression. I got so low that the only thing keeping me on the planet was my wife, three daughters, and a few shipmates. My wife took the first steps to reach out for me and laid the groundwork with the Behavioral Health Clinic at Walter Reed Bethesda, which led me ultimately to seek help. At that point, my entire chain of command didn't know what was going on with me. They just knew that I took unannounced leave in the middle of the week. At my first meeting with the doctor, I was quite skeptical. My thoughts quickly shifted to relief because he paid attention to what I was saying and took me seriously. I was prepared for indifference because they didn't believe me, or the worst case, which is being thrown out of the Navy. End result of that meeting with the doctor, I was diagnosed with a mild form of depression that stays with you for years. It just became a part of my life. As treatment, I began seeing a therapist every Friday, and she is phenomenal. The reason she is is because she pays attention and allows me the ability to come to my own decisions on what's best for me. I sit here today, a senior chief with 16 years of service, maintaining my clearance and my Navy career. I talked to many people over the months leading to my decision to self-refer. I wanted to make sure that I didn't compound my situation and end up losing my job and end up not being able to take care of my wife and kids. It was a planned decision, but it wasn't perfect. Until I saw the doctor, I didn't know how it would really turn out. I am proof that the Navy has rightly shifted, shifted the rudder on how we view these types of problems. Now, my disclaimer is that my experience won't be shared by all. If you do reach out, I can't guarantee the same results, but I will respect you greatly if you reach out for help. My vision as a father, husband, leader, and follower has come quite a bit clearer. I'm refocused on what's important to me, which is my impact on others. Again, you will have a different base for your strength, but finding your calling is the goal. I'll leave you with this thought. We are charged not only as Navy professionals, but as human beings to fully shift the paradigm on speaking up about stress and depression. It's a sign of strength. We need to stop treating this like our grandparents and parents' generation did. Depression or other things that impact us psychologically are no longer lumped together as the white elephant in the room. Don't let anybody kid you into, into thinking that it doesn't take more strength to ask for help than to stomach the problem. It was a huge risk for me, but even if it was calculated. In the end, the risk actually paid off. From my wife's ex support, to my experience with my doctor, to continue to thrive in my Navy career, nearly do two decades later, this was the turning point in my life that proved to me that it's okay to speak up when you're down. Lastly, stop me in the passageway if you see me. I'd love to talk to you about my experiences if it'll help you. Thank you for your time.